Wow, this was out of this world. It brought to light and it brought a demonstration of what apostles and apostolic really means. It's not a denomination, it's a way of life. It's who we are, it's what we do. From every message, line upon line, and precept upon precept, God really revealed his mind. He empowered the people. We saw signs, wonders, and miracles. It was just a great and awesome experience. God's spirit was truly in the house. The worship was awesome. And uh, it, just, it just brought clarity to my mind. Come on, God's looking for some firebrands today. God's looking for some people that are not ashamed of the gospel of Jesus Christ because we recognize it is the power of God unto salvation. Now at the beginning of this year, the Lord gave me an, an interesting word. And the Lord said to me, this will be a year of the quantum leap. It means a sudden and significant change or increase. How many here need a sudden or significant change or increase? In Genesis chapter 50, Joseph said, what you meant against me for evil, God has turned for my good. So I hear the Lord saying he is going to redeem the time for his people. Amen. You know, I, I see the word of the Lord as something God uses to encourage us to bet you in. And it just looks like the next day things fall apart. How can God speak to me and yet things doesn't work? Because he wasn't talking to you. <laughs> He was talking to the you that is in you that need to emerge. God works on the dream before he works on the dream. You can never become the fullness of the picture that the Spirit of God ordained for you until you come into alignment with the process of God. When God speaks to me, his assignment is to process me and bring me to the place where I become the picture of that which he has spoken. And God, you got to get to that place that you understand in your spirit. It is never over until God completes his assignment. We've already been well taught by a bishop, but then the bishop has been given a access to a company of other people who have been so tremendously empowered by God in the apostolic and the prophetic. Uh, last night and this morning has been wonderful. I can express how great an uh, impact it has been in my spirit, and I am occupying my position and looking for more. I tell you, we have shifted to another dimension. I tell you, we've taking a quantum leap into another arena in the spirit realm. Not only a knowledge and awareness, but also an activity, a demonstration, the power of the Holy Ghost. The true Christian life is the greatest adventure you could ever have. You know, his yoke is easy. His burden is light. This is training for reigning. We need the trials. Now he will bless a lot of things he will not inhabit. <laughs> and we've got to mature beyond just seeking the blessings. Remember the first two to follow Jesus. He turned around and he challenged him. He said, what do you seek? And I think he's challenging all of his people today with that same question. What are we after? Anyone here could, I believe, become God's best friend in the last days. You know, that's the essence of true prophetic ministry, is simple friendship with God. Where you are such a friend of God, He doesn't want to do anything without sharing it with His friend. Man, Occupy has been amazing. Uh, it's just been a place where I've learned to become better. It's given me a greater sense of destiny, who I am on earth while I'm here. Um, it's given me purpose, um, sound direction of what an apostle is. I like the name of the conference, don't you, Occupy? Jesus said, Occupy till I come. 
That means we've got work to do. We are not finished yet. Amen. How you see Jesus is going to determine what you believe. You, as representatives of Christ, are representatives of the highest government the world's ever seen. The church of Jesus Christ is a governing church. It is the seed of God's governing authority. Amen. Lord, I speak to the gifts inside of these people. And I command them to come alive in the name of Jesus. Thank you for these warriors, God. These mighty sons and daughters of the Most High God. They shall turn the world upside down. Thank you, Lord. This was phenomenal. This was great. We were more to come next year. We're looking forward to that. But 2014, what a phenomenal Occupy we had.